Okay, so um, <clears throat> we are doing a giveaway today. We're doing a tournament. Um, we are uh, doing this bracket, bracket challenge. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it, but uh, this is from Jose Ochoa, who is another reactor. Uh, he posted this on Twitter, and I thought it'd be fun if we did it uh, during this live today. If you look at the uh, the middle part, uh, we have they're numbered one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, the person who accurately matches one, two, three, four, five, six, seven is going to win a Google Mini Home. Uh, courtesy of our channel you cannot see it I will make it a lot bigger um, for you to uh, see just give me one second can you see it so we are doing this giveaway uh, I will give you about uh, five to ten minutes um, and you can fill it out think about it and all you have to do is uh, all you have to do is uh, write down one two three four five six seven who you think will be in those brackets and just put it down in the comments below Okay, so if you see the pink and the beige, they are numbered one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, you have to guess which songs will go in those brackets, in those numbers, and just write it down in the comments section uh, of the video that you're watching right now. We're not going to listen to all of them. But uh, we are going to uh, react to maybe one or two of the songs that I didn't uh, <laughs> that I didn't I didn't uh, react to yet. <clears throat> so I'll give you a hint. Uh, Fire is the first winner. Okay. Comments are not enabled. Kalila, can you go over and enable the comments? <laughs> you know what? You could just write it down here. No, you see, you see the pink, you see the pink boxes. You have to guess those. You don't have to guess the the blue boxes, just the pink ones. Okay. So write one, and the song name number two, the song name, and then number seven is the actual winner of this contest. If you can see the diagram. There you go, Manel.
Hi. I need a cha-cha beat, boy. Okay, so everybody is understanding it now. All right. Guys, just write your answers in one uh, in one shot. <laughs> Yes, we're supposed to pick the songs that I I am going to select. I am going to do this diagram today, and I will announce my winner of this tournament uh, today. Yes, seven is the best. Seven is the actual winner. So everybody knows I like Boy With Love, huh? <laughs> That's not a secret, huh? Alright, <clears throat> so after this song, we're going to start the tournament, so get your uh, entries in there. Yes, you have to guess number seven. Seven is the winner. You guys are way too smart. You got 20 seconds to get your entries in. All right, guys, we're started. <clears throat> Okay, so uh, some of these songs that I didn't uh, I, I didn't know, uh, so I had to listen to it uh, earlier today. Uh, so Fire did beat Not Today. Not Today, uh, Fire, they're both very similar kinds of songs. Uh, they're very hype songs with um, strong EDM uh, presence. Uh, I liked Fire just a little bit more because the the 
the melody was better um, and the hook was better. Not Today was really, um, it hyped me up a lot, but uh, the song or the melody wasn't uh, as good as Fire. So Fire wins, which you guys already knew. Uh, moving on. So No More Dream vs. Eno. Um, and the winner of that is Eno. Uh, both songs I didn't really, really enjoy. Uh, they were more uh, earlier, earlier songs. But uh, Anno, Anno was a uh, just a little bit more better. Now moving on, we did. Uh, we are bulletproof and danger. These are two uh, earlier songs as well. Um, and the winner of that was Danger. Uh, Danger is actually a pretty good song. Uh, I, en I enjoyed the, mm, <clears throat> the choreography uh, immensely. Um, it, it's, not, it's not a modern song by any stretch, but uh, it's pretty fun. Melody's catchy. Uh, I like it. I like it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Someone goes, are you kidding me? <laughs> so far, I think uh, people are uh, people are in agreement. All right. So uh, just one day versus brand new day. Um, I think you guys um, know how much I love Brand New Day, so that's pretty easy. That's, you know, there's nothing more to say. I love Brand New Day so much. <laughs> it's just a, a very high quality song with um, great vocals and great instrumentals. Dream Glow versus All Night. This is when I really started uh, understanding about BTS. It was when the, the, the game OSTs came out. And um, Dream Glow was sung with uh, Charlie something. And uh, I had a big problem with it, which was the, uh, the chorus part. The chorus. Uh, melody. I don't like it when they chop uh, one uh, one vowel into uh, multiple notes, like the eh 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 part. Uh, that's really it. Really bothers me. Um, there was another song um, by Twenty One that did that. It goes eh 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 eh, and um, I have a problem with that. That's really lazy uh, songwriting, in my opinion. And um, for me, All Night was better. Uh, I think uh, All Night, All Night, All Night, All Night, yes, yes, that song was a lot better. So we'll chuck up uh, All Night up here. All Night is a bop, your favorite. Okay. So some are. Some are with me here. All right, so Boy in Love with Boy with Love. Um, this is where I think a lot of people might uh, disagree. But for me, Boy with Love is... Uh, Boy with Love is one of my favorite songs by BTS ever. Um, you know, it, it's kind of fluffy and light. And, you know, really, really... Um, Popish, but if you listen to the 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 song, the instrumentals, um, it's so dream, dreamy. I mean, it, 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 the sounds are just such high quality. Um, you can't, uh, you know, a lot of people will think that it's fluff pop, but underlying uh, the underlying music is really really high quality, and nobody can deny that. So. Boy with Love. Now this one was really hard. 
Uh, Blood, Sweat, and Tears versus Fake Love. I think uh, both came out around the same time, um, right after each other. <laughs> and both were very good as well. Um, for me, for me, uh, Fake Love is just a little bit ahead of Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, fake love, fake love wins. Uh, you know, fake love. Interestingly enough, um, it features one of the best raps ever by this group. Uh, all three, all three uh, rappers were excellent. Um, it was one of my favorite raps by RM. One of my favorite raps by Suga and by J Hope. It was. It was a slam dunk for all three rappers, and the uh, the melody, the music video, uh, everything about it was was top notch. Um, you know, there's there's no fault in this uh, in this song. So, um, fake love wins out against blood, sweat, and tears. Now. I Need You versus Run. This is probably uh, hardcore army enthusiasts. Um, you know, they love both songs so much. Um, who wins? I Need You, girl. Um, you know why? Uh, for me, the Seesaw Remix. The Seesaw Remix just... Uh, changed my opinion about this song so much. Um, yeah, that that won it for this song for this uh, this battle. Wow, everyone is split with this one. Okay, it's like choosing between my pets. I can't choose. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I, I really like that Seesaw remix. Uh, that's on my playlist uh, right now. Moving on, we are going to the other side where we have War of Hormones versus Dope. Now, uh, I did listen to both songs, but uh, I think uh, this is where we're going to do our first uh, reaction. Um, We're gonna listen to uh, "Dope" together and do a an official reaction video. Wait, "Dope" is the winner. <clears throat> uh, War of Hormones was good; it was creative, but uh, "Dope" has this special quality about about it. So, um, you know, I think. Uh, this is when a lot of people started uh, noticing uh, BTS. I think it probably the first uh, mm, internationally known release, I guess. I think this is when it really started. All right, moving on. Young Forever and Save Me. Um, I remember I did uh, Young Forever. Um, I didn't, it's not the original, but it's, uh, when all of you armies started crying and, and singing, uh, no, you were not crying. You were singing and, and BTS was crying and, uh, I made fun of your vocals. Um, <clears throat> but save me is too good of a song. <laughs> you know, you, can <laughs> um, so. That's an easy one. Save me wins. Save me, save me. Ooh, what happened? Save me wins. <clears throat> Rena was crying too when she was watching uh, The Young Forever. Uh, 
I, I believe that was Wembley. Jeez, I know too much. How do I know that's Wembley? Was it Wembley? Was it Wembley? Please confirm that I am crazy. <laughs> Wembley Day 2. <laughs> okay. All right, moving on. Spring Day versus Heartbeat. This is like no contest. Boom. I think uh, for every uh, person who's who knows both songs, we'll pick uh, Spring Day. This is no explanation needed. Ah, so the next one is DNA versus Idol. Oh, wow. <clears throat> Uh, DNA versus Idol. Wow, there was actually somebody who picked Heartbeat. Okay, DNA versus Idol. Uh, I remember I picked... So both songs came out uh, right after each other. Um, DNA was okay, but Idol had something special uh, to it as well. Um, I just like the the beat to it, the vibe. It's a really, really, um, it's a really upbeat song with a crazy, crazy, crazy uh, music video. So, Idol wins, and I think most of you agree. Hmm. You know, for me, I don't, I don't think uh, I don't think DNA is up there in, 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 um, with the other uh, legendary or, or high quality songs of BTS. I, I, it, it, it falls kind of short for me. Um, you know, it, something's missing with that song, and, and it's. <clears throat> it's it's the baseline, <laughs> the baseline, you know, it's, uh, for me, it's overrated. Uh, it gets too much hype for, for what it is. Anyways, now this one was, uh, very difficult for me. Make it right versus mic drop. Uh, for me, both songs were, uh, very, very well done in their own, uh, respective styles, <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, I want to see what other people think. Mic drop versus make it right. What would you guys say? Mic drop, mic drop, make, mic drop. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the overwhelming majority picks Mic Drop. Okay. Well, Gino is not an army, and Gino picks Make It Right. Uh, <laughs> I know Mic Drop is probably one of the most iconic songs for uh, BTS. Um, and rightfully so. Uh, there is something very special about Mic Drop, um, but make it right. You can't deny it. It's it, the the quality of that song, um, especially right now, uh, where the style is trending. Uh, this kind of style, uh, popularized by Ed Sheeran. Um, it's just so perfect for for right now, and, and you know it's uh, <clears throat> it's perfect for the U.S. market. It, it is, and um, even if you're not a BTS fan or, or K-pop fan, you can still appreciate this song. 
um, because it mixes well with uh, with today's uh, music trends and that uh, instrument that uh, Ed Sheeran uses. I don't know what to call that. The f uh, flute or saxophone or clarinet or whatever he used. Um, rigged. <laughs> <laughs> it was rigged, yeah. Ed Sheeran paid me to uh, uh, to uh, hype up, make it right. <laughs> uh, for me, uh, make it right is better. It's just it's just high quality all around, and um, maybe if it was three years ago or two years ago when Mike Drop came out. Uh, it would have been different, but right now, as it is, um, make it right. Make it right should be in the top ten of the uh, Billboard. Uh, there's no reason it shouldn't be. <laughs> I'm sorry if this contest is rigged. It's rigged um, in favor of Gene Gino's selections. All right, moving on. For you versus lights. Uh, you know, it lights simply for the fact that, uh, I re you know, what? first of all, let me tell you this. I don't really particularly enjoy the Japanese releases. Um, I, I, I have a difficult time connecting with, with their style. Um, the beats, beats are very different in Japan. And the st actually, the style of music is different in Japan. So, uh, I have a very difficult time uh, connecting with um, the Japanese releases. However, um, there is one part in this song, Lights, uh, that I really, really like. Uh, and that's Jungkook's part. It's just, it, it makes the song. It, it, it uh, uh, connects the song, I, I, I can say. Um, and that was the, the tiebreaker. All right, so Lights moves on. Now, Crystal Snow versus Airplane Part 2. Uh, for me, you know, I, a lot, I had to listen to a lot of new songs because of this. Because of this chart, <laughs> uh, and and for me, wow! Everybody picks Crystal Snow, and I pick Airplane Part Two. That's. That's pretty surprising. Everybody picking Crystal Snow. Okay. Now, I don't know about this last matchup. Idol featuring Nicki Minaj versus Make It Right featuring Love. Now, whoever made this chart is just uh, trolling now at this point. But uh, this is an unnecessary matchup that was just... Stuck in there. <clears throat> um, Idol versus Nikki versus Make It Right. Uh, <laughs> am I gonna get canceled because uh, uh, Crystal Snow lost? <laughs> Definitely make it right featuring love uh, wins. Uh, for those of you who joined late, we are going to do Armypedia uh, right after this. And we're also going to react to uh, Dimple Live. So uh, stick with us.
Hey, hey. What is let go? There's let go and then go go? Jeez, there's so many songs. <clears throat> Japanese masterpiece. I have no idea what this song is. One three four 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 three two three four four zero 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 three 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 four 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 three. What is this song? Why is the title like that? an odd title <clears throat> um, <laughs> geez there's so many songs it's uh <clears throat> there's no end to this I th you know I, I'm I'm reacting like to multiple songs a week and there's no end like how deep does it go geez um, I do have a request. I want to do a one of those uh, compilation videos like that uh, Celeste made before, like who is BTS or or B I don't know. Uh, are you BTS or remember those uh, old compilation videos I reacted to a long time ago? <laughs> If there are any new ones uh, like that, updated ones, um, please tell me because I would really like to uh, <clears throat> to know. <clears throat> because I don't, I'm not like on Twitter and, and YouTube watching uh, all this stuff. Like I'm not really up to date on what is happening. Um, I just hear from you guys and that's how I learn. Um, and I, I know their music more than uh, more than anything else. <clears throat> um, Adam, if you could uh, give me a good recommendation, um, we can we can talk later to find one for next week. Uh, I know a lot of you guys want four o'clock as well, uh, but it won't be today. And neither will be one four three 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 four 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 zero zero three four zero. Uh, we'll do that at a, at a later time. Today we're only going to do uh, this tournament. Armypedia was actually like twenty five minutes, um, and then we will finish it off with um, Dimple Live. Yeah. I'm also contemplating, maybe we should listen to Decalcomania uh, because uh, uh, we should do a re-listen. Gosh, I need that song out. Please, come on. All right, moving on. We are going to do the final eight. The 
Final eight consists of fire. Oh, I gotta go small now. Gino's going small. Boing. Okay. All right, if you see final versus, uh, I'm sorry, uh, fire versus brand new day. Uh, <laughs> you know what? I, I think I'm very, uh, <clears throat> very predictable. Um, and many of you guys know um, which songs I really, really like. Um, and this is where I pull out the uh, la, 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 that part. Uh, which I didn't like in fire and I will use that excuse uh, for brand new day toppling fire um, so brand new day wins over fire <clears throat> easy 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 all right moving on Boy with love versus fake love. Oh, wow. This is very difficult, huh? Boy with love versus fake love. What about you guys? What about you guys? I I can't even remember uh, who, who won, actually, for me. Let me see. Fake love versus boy with love. Hmm. Hmm. Fake love. Oh wow. Okay. That is surprising. I didn't know everybody would pick a uh, fake love. That's uh. uh I'm sorry. I was a uh, yeah. Fake, okay, overwhelmingly fake love. Um, for me, it was boy with love. Uh, fake love extended version. No, no, no. For me, it was a. Uh, <coughs> um. Boy with love, because because it's boy with love. It's just an awesome song. <laughs> so I'm sorry. Um, I know we're gonna we're gonna fight probably uh, here. It's gonna get it's gonna get dirty. So rigged. Uh, well, I haven't listened to the extended version. Um, I don't, I don't know if that'll change my decision, but, uh, Boy With Love is awesome. Uh, I, I sell ya. I feel you. All right, moving on. This is, uh, getting serious right here, right here, right here. So remember when you guys, uh, filled in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, this is what we're doing now. The pink. All right, so uh, there are several people who have uh, uh, gotten it correctly so far. So you guys are in the hunt for this brand new Google Mini Home, Google Home Mini. All right, so um, it's still alive. The contest is still alive. All right, so we're moving on. We're going uh, make it right versus crystal snow. <laughs> I gotta. <laughs> Who said airplane part two? Camila. Camila. There is no. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, make it right versus crystal snow. You guys know, you guys know which songs I like. 
Ta -da. Make it right. Make it right wins. So this is the final four. Brand new day. Spring day. Boy with love. Make it right. Jeez, there's a lot of crystal snow enthusiasts. Oh my gosh. I'm not that... <laughs> All right, you can't change my mind right now. My ears are not that thin. Rigged. All right, so look it over. Look it over. It's brand new day versus spring day. Oh, we're going to fight, aren't we? Oh, it's going to get dirty between us. The comment section is going to look nasty for this video. I can, I can already feel it. Oh, man. Boy with love versus make it right. That's difficult too. Oh my gosh. You know, actually, um, all four of these songs are, uh, should be on the radio with no problem. There should be no problem. All right, you ready? You ready, Genosaurs? There's gonna be a lot less Genosaurs after this. <laughs> All right, brand new day versus spring day. Can we get a drum roll? The winner is... Brand new day. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> uh, before you uh, murder me, um, you have to understand spring day it has, uh, you guys call it the queen. Uh, it has very lasting uh, uh, impact, um, longevity. But uh, it doesn't come in with a bang, honestly. Uh, it's one of those songs that you will never get sick of. Um, but it's, it doesn't come with a bang. The way Brand New Day comes in. Uh, Brand New Day could be on the charts in, 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 in America. No problem. And... It's a good song. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's a, it's it wins. I'm sorry. <clears throat> uh yeah, brand new day wins. Uh perhaps uh Brick's life his chart will be different and have a spring day. But uh uh, Gino Life has brand new day. Moving on. Uh, Boy with love versus make it right. Boy with love versus make it right. And we have Boy with love. So, brand new day versus boy with love. B B W L. Saying B W L is much more difficult than saying actual boy with love. Uh, 
You know that, right? All right, so this is the uh, the championship. Uh, there are, I believe, two people right now that are have gotten the chart correct. So, someone's gonna win this speaker, huh? Okay, <clears throat> we will find out soon enough. Gino is over party. <laughs> it's been nice knowing you guys, you know, I, I, I loved you guys. Um, you know, if you guys uh, change your mind, I'll, I'll, I'll be here. I'll be here uh, listening to uh, to Joppin and uh, Superhuman, all right? I'll be in my corner. Gino is canceled party. Gino sores are leaving. Yeah, <laughs> uh, reported. You know, I love it when um, salty fans uh, write in the comments that they reported me. Like, for what? <laughs> for not liking your group song? <laughs> like, <laughs> reported and canceled. Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Alright, we'll check it out now. Drum roll, drum roll. Brand new day. Versus. Muddy. Brand new day. Versus Muddy Muddy <laughs> Brand new day. I made it so anticlimactic because of Muddy's barking. Uh, brand new day versus Boy with Love. And the winner is, the winner is, the winner is. Ta da! Brand new day. Is that surprising to you guys? Is that a good winner? <laughs> Rigged. I love this song. <clears throat> How am I so predictable? Jeez.
my wife. the song because she's my wife <laughs> how many wives do I have You know what would be very nice if they were ac actually able to uh, sing this live, uh, all three of them together. Um, that would be very nice. Uh, no, I don't like the song just because of Zara, although I think her voice complements uh, V's uh, singing very well. Uh, it's just the, uh, the contrast. There's such a contrast between the three. Uh, you would never imagine um, V uh doing a song with j-hope the two of them together um because they're so different um but and, but then you add uh, a sweet voice of zara and you have three very very different styles and they all come together uh on a very modern but yet traditional track uh and it's a very simple track and, and there's just there's a there's beauty in that simplicity uh, and there's beauty in that uh, mm, the, the, the Korean traditional sound uh, and it, it just all comes together really well um, and <laughs> it's just masterfully done masterfully done <clears throat> you know there are other songs that I would uh, rate this uh, rate ahead of this um, and a lot of them have happen to be uh you know songs i like uh better than this would probably be like soul or seesaw or uh euphoria or serendipity or mm, decalcomania you know there's a lot of songs that i, I do like um uh, but they just weren't included in this chart and um I imagine a lot of people they will have uh, Spring Day or Boy With Love or Fake Love as their favorites but uh, mm, yeah I, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with my chart it, this chart is limited um, I'm, I'm not in any way saying Brand New Day is their best song it's just whatever uh, was available on this chart 